What's up guys, Danger Yu-Gi-Oh! channel here, Danger speaking, and today we're going to be doing the next episode of the random pack opening series. We have a ton of packs still left open, so look, it's definitely nice and mixed up now, but I am going to shuffle a few things around because I don't like seeing the same pack next to each other in the same area, you know? It makes it feel like things aren't too mixed up yet. So, let's see, let's take this, drop it right there. Hmm. Actually, that should be fairly well mixed up, but let's flip everything around now. And get everything ready to go for the next round of it. So, let's get all the packs mixed up. Gotta move part of the background there. I keep bumping into it with the packs. Making sure I keep all the packs face down as I do this. Okay. Now I'm going to randomly choose 10 packs, and then we'll see what we can get. Let's see, how many do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. Okay. So let's get all this out of the way now. I have no idea what sets we have here for this opening. Uh, I do, I did feel a couple of packs were thinner packs, but we have a we have quite a few different sets that are thin, so don't know what we're going to be getting here. Um, just so you guys know, we did get these packs from multiple locations, so a little hard to figure out what ratios we have here. Uh, some of the stuff did come from special editions. That was basically used to fill in spots that we needed. So we do have quite a few unlimited packs here, but we do have quite a few first eds as well. So let's see what we got. We have a Hidden Arsenal 3, Invasion Vengeance, Code of the Duelist, Hidden Arsenal 3, two OTS pack 7s, a copy of Ancient Sanctuary, two more Hidden Arsenal 3s, and a Duelist pack Chaz Princeton. Wow. So we ended up with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven packs with five or less cards in them. Wow. That's crazy, guys. I think I'm actually going to choose some stuff from this set and put back these four packs. I don't want to have a lot of smaller stuff, so... One, two, three, four. Okay, so four packs out. Replacing with four other packs. I kind of want to save some of the older stuff for later openings, so. Okay, so what did we add in? We added in a Circuit Break, a Battles of Legends, Lights, Revenge, Photon, Shockwave, and a Star Pack Frames. Okay, so. Now that we're definitely ready to go now. Let's crack into it, starting off with the Star Pack Frames. Okay, so we have a Fire Prison. Salvage Driver and Three Strikes Barrier. Photon Shockwave. This is an old one. Okay, so we have Wat Cobra, Evo Karma, Prior of the Ice Barrier, Sound the Retreat, Tribe Shocking Virus, and a Super Rare Black Ray Lancer. Hey, that's pretty cool. Nice, we actually got a Super Rare from that. Natria Marin, Monster Slots, and Shark Stickers. That's not bad. Got a super rare. It's unlimited, but still, that's pretty cool. So, first edition Battles of Legend Lights Revenge. Alright, let's get some Time Lord and Light Sworn stuff. That would be cool. 
Okay, so we have number 11, Big Eye. Hey, starting off strong there. Raid Raptor, Rudder Strix. Wolf, Light Sworn, Beast. Came beyond the Time Lord, so we got a Time Lord. And our secret rare is Gladiator, Beast, Noxious. That's pretty cool. Circuit Break. Come on, guys. Borlo Dragon. I could totally use one to actually play. So we got a Crawler, Ranveer, Crawler Guile, Infernal... Link Inferno Flyer, the Accumulator, Subterra Behemoth Fiendus, and Metafeast Tyrant Dragon. FA Turbocharger, FA Pitstop, and Capacitor Stalker. Oh, we got the we got the Subterra Link monster, that's pretty cool. Check this out, guys. A pack of Ancient Sanctuary. This set is so old. In ancient Egypt, there existed a force so powerful it had to be locked away for a millennia. Now one boy has released the power. It's time to duel! Wow. Seriously though, some packs of Ancient Sanctuary. That's just amazing to be able to add that to this opening. So we're starting off with a Solar Flare Dragon. The Law of the Normal. Metal Armored Bug. Wow. That was a big card back then. Solar Ray. King of the Swamp! Hex, yeah, I will totally take a King of the Swamp. That's beautiful. Even though we got a rare instead of a hollow, I totally take King of the Swamp on hollow face. This card was so hard for me to get back in the day, especially when I needed it for my Elemental Hero deck. Wow, that is nice. I may end up adding that to the um, binder. I don't know. Pharaonic Protector? That's pretty cool. The mummy of a soldier that has been guarding the royal family for thousands of years. Even now, its spirit does not allow anybody to trespass. But it's so tiny. Hey, look, Desert Sunlight. Heh. That's pretty good for Super Heavy Samurais, actually. That is really good for Super Heavy Samurais. Wow! I'm planning on building that soon, and wow, that is a great card to add in. Spirit Caller and Blessing of the Nile. Wow. So we got a couple of cool commons and a really cool rare there. Okay, so we got a OTS pack 7. Come on, ultimate rares. I would love to get an ultimate rare, guys. That would be just beautiful. So we got a Prickle Fairy, Spell Power Grasp, and a Paleozoic Dino Miscus. Well, got a Paleo at least, that's pretty cool. I'll definitely take the Paleo. Hidden Arsenal 3. Come on, guys. Let's get some of that Dragoonity stuff. So we got Worm Victory as our secret rare. Wow, that's pretty cool. Worm Ugly, that is ugly. Natria Hygien ah, Hydrangea. Fabled Toppy, I don't think I've ever seen that card. And then Natria Tulip. Well, between these Natria things and the fact that I bought a collection somewhat recently that had a bunch of Natria stuff in it, I may end up building Natrias for you guys. Code of the Duelist, come on. Two cards, Firewall and Negrasu, where are you? So we have a DD Vice Typhoon. Emerging Emergency, Rescue to Rescue, World Legacy's Heart, Chosen by the World Chalice, and Gaia Saber the Lightning Shadow. Okay. Another Gaia Saber. I will totally take that. That is my generic Link monster in Trick Stars. Hex yeah. World Legacy, World Chalice. Really wish I'd gotten the super rare from that OTS pack. Orbital Hydra Lander, Gravity Lash, and Twilight Twin Dragons. Two packs left, guys. Invasion Vengeance First Ed. Okay, so we have Paleozoic Dinomiscus. Well, that's familiar. Kermicutter Oxyox. Flower Cardian Clover with Boar. Fraud Freeze. Nine Pillars of the Yang Zing. And Denglong First of the Yang Zing. Nice! First Ed. I mean, if it wasn't banned, that would be just amazing to get. But that's still really cool. For those of you that play traditional, a nice copy of Denglong. Chrome Critter Carbo Crab. Predator Planet Squid Drosia. And Pandora's Jewelry Box. Nice. 
And a final copy of Hidden Arsenal 3. Whoa. That one just wanted to shred. Okay, guys. I'm going to pull the secret to the back this time for a little more suspense. So we have R Gen X Oracle, Natria Dragonfly, Worm Zex, R Gen X Turbo, and Ally of Justice Decisive Armor. That's pretty. For a second there, I thought we had a Cataster. That would have been really cool. But look at that, guys. That is a beautiful secret rare. That was an amazing opening, guys. We ended up getting some very nice commons and rares. We got a couple of really cool secrets. And a super from a set we weren't guaranteed one. So, anyways, I want to thank you guys for watching. As always, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And this is the Danger Yu-Gi-Oh! channel, signing off.